Good afternoon children. Welcome back to science class. Today we are going to start a new lesson. Lesson 5 energy. Can you uh, hear about energy? What's the meaning of energy? Energy means what? The capacity to do work. Ability to do work. That's called energy. And then energy is the one that is the one that is the one that is the one Can you uh, do uh, anything without energy? No. If you are tired, we will say we, are, we have no energy to do work. We have no energy for that work. So uh, let us learn more about energy and what are the different forms of energy in this chapter. Then from where we get energy. These all these things we are going to discuss the, in this chapter. Okay. Uh, take your textbook children. 157. Page number 157. One uh, yellow column is there that you look. Anything that happens from a pin dropping to a volcanic eruption requires energy. That means any work we need to do, right? small work to any hard work, that means what? It requires energy. We walk, talk to a person bubbling over the air with energy, being a hyperactive. There are many uh, biscuits and uh, energy drinks. Why is so much importance to give on to this energy? If we are tired, we will eat some biscuit or some sweets that, that will uh, give us energy. And some uh, health drink that also will give some energy, energy drinks also. That why we are giving this much importance to energy? Because energy is very uh, important in our life. Without energy, we cannot do any work. Ener What's the meaning of energy, children? Energy is the capacity. Capacity means ability. Capacity to do work. That's the definition. In that definition, energy is the capacity to do work. What's the definition of energy? Energy is the capacity to do work. When we feel tired, after doing some work or playing after, we feel tired. Then we will say, we have no energy to do anything. That means, energy makes thing, all things happen. Energy makes all things happen. If without energy, we can't do any work. Without energy, the entire universe would be cold and dark. If you have no energy, the whole world will be look in which manner? In dark and cold. There would be no light and no movement. If energy only for, uh, energy needed for movement and energy is needed for light, for everything. There is no if there is no energy, there is no movement in the earth. There are many kinds of energy, such as, what are the different kinds of energy, children? Heat energy, light energy, chemical energy, electric, electrical energy, all this energy we have. And sound energy. Whenever we use energy, it changes from one form to another. Whenever we use energy, one form of energy we use, it changes from one form to another form. When uh, we switch on light, if you switch on the light, what's the light? The light is going on which, which uh, energy? Electric energy. That electric energy is then changes when we switch on a light, the electrical energy changes into which and which? What and what energy? Light energy and heat energy. 
both two energy are convert to light energy are to heat energy are to switch on to for electrical energy convert to when we run nammal run cheyumbol alle odumbol play cheyumbol when we run or when we play or when we do work the chemical energy produced by food in, in the body is changed into uh, movement or muscular energy end energy ait change muscular energy ait adhaid nammal kaicha food il nilla energy end energy aanu food il ullathu chemical energy the food contains chemical energy that is converted into muscular energy nammade muscle lude movement ait alle muscular energy ait adu convert cheyi okay then from where do we get energy children we get energy from the food we eat from where we do get, get energy the energy we uh, we get energy from the food we eat Uh, the food is a fuel or indhana vaana le food endha vaana or indhana vaana food is a fuel that provides energy to make our bodies work le nammade body work cheyana avashyamaya fuel tharuna or nammade body work cheyana avashyamaya energy nalguna or fuel aanu food but unlike the fuel that other motors work alle mattu motor vahanangal work cheynadu pole alla nammalde fuel food and the fuel what's the difference uh, the food we eat contains balanced diet that means different kinds of nutrients the food we eat contain different kinds of nutrients that it must be a balanced diet then all we uh, we can do the work the energy in the food is measured in unit one unit le oru unit upayogichana nammal kaikkina aharathile energy measure cheyina which unit is we are using children we are using kilo calories underline that word which unit we are using to measure the energy inside the food kilo calories k C A L kilo calories. What's it? Kilo calories. K C L kilo calories. According to the work we do, we need energy. According to our work, we need more energy. If you are doing hard work, we need more energy. If you are doing uh, not that much hard work, we need less energy. according to our work we need uh, we need energy how much it is it uh, will be 1500 to 4000 kilo calories energy per day that is one day namakku venda energy athrayana 1500 thotte 4000 vare energy namakku aavashyamana we need that much energy Yeah, one gram of sugar will have more kilo calories than one gram of apple. Apple is a fruit, no? Apple is a fruit, but sugar, uh, sugar we get from sugar we get more energy than apple. Both sweet, like apple sweet, and sugar sweet, but energy level is different. A gram of water will be more uh, higher. Uh, More kilo calories than gram of sugar. So, butter la na kilo sugar ne kal kudal. So, oru food for food items wale kumre, adde energy level de onil onna different day. Like energy level de different day. So, per day na kum kendo re, hamada work chey na kum kendo re energy aswa na one thousand five hundred to four thousand kilo calories energy. Okay. Uh, then uh, the different uh, food items have different energy apple uh, one gram of apple is less energy than one gram of sugar and one gram of sugar is less energy than one gram of butter in that way uh, all uh, food items have different uh, kilo calories okay you should read the energy that first page first page of energy, lesson 5 Energy is first page. You must, you must read, and kilocalories you have to underline. 
then uh, another important uh, hard words kilo calories then that uh, how much we need per day how much kilo calories that words you have to underline then uh, any hard word is there uh, different energies uh, name heat energy uh, light energy electrical energy sound energy that also you have to underline and write as well okay this much today's class uh, you have to read that much five times it's the time to write the fourth class thank you